325. We need some way to differentiate between tiles that are mirrored on the X or Y axis. Right now, everything is completely symmetrical. So even if we were to use the mirroring flags and our auto tile values, we wouldn't be able to see the results. So we need to fix that by adding asymmetry to our tile designs. In the top level constant macros, we've added these constants here. They're eight by four bitmaps encoded into uint 32s. We have top, we have not top, left, center, and right designs. What we did previously. Okay, so anyways, down here, the not design is just all blanks. It's gonna be used to fill out the bottom halves of these designs we created. This is a top cap a left cap, a center cap, and a right cap. The dashes here are placeholders for zeros. So in the Art Gola layout for an auto tile set, not all of these are gonna get cap graphics, only the ones that are, well, on the top. So on the Nonagon set, we have the left, center, and right. On the vertical set, we have the top. Same thing with the Don't Touch Me set, also a top. And then on the horizontal set, we have the left, center, and right graphics. Now we need to splice it together with the 8x4 not graphic because these graphics only fill up half of the tile because they're 8x4 grids and we need to use two tiles to create an 8x8 grid. We have the math for how we calculated these values, but we don't have enough time in this video to go over all that detail. So here's what we did in this video. If you want a more detailed description of how we calculated these, you can go here. You're on the short playlist. You can get the source code here, and you can email me here. You have been on video number 325, hence the number in the bottom right of the screen. Like, subscribe.